Hi everybody, it's Lolita Path Over Net. Thank you for clicking on the video. Today I have a haul. It's an impromptu haul. I went to a beauty supply store to buy two things, maybe three, um, because it is something that I love and when I go to get it, a lot of times it's out of stock, so I tend to buy it in bulk. I buy two to three at a time. So I only went to get one thing, but multiple jars of that one thing. That makes sense? Y'all know what I'm talking about. So I'm going to show you what I went to get. I went to get the African Pride Pre-Shampoo uh, Aloe and Coconut Water. I love this stuff. Out of all the products that I have, um, I have products that I say, oh, well, I love it, I love it. But honestly, this is the only thing that I buy two, three, four at one single time. So I went to get this. Well, shit. Like that. <laughs> I went to get this. And I ended up getting this. <laughs> so, um, so, I have the pre-shampoo, what I went to get. But I also purchased, so I was looking around and looking around. I love, Starbucks and a beauty supply store are the two stores that I love to go to. So I went by Starbucks as well, had my little coffee this morning. But anyway, so I was roaming the aisles, roaming the aisles, and I, well, I saw this. It's, yeah, it's Shine of the Time. It's a hair gloss, hair mist by Giovanni. Can you guys see that? So I, th I saw this, and I was like, hmm, I don't have a shine mist. And I really had to think about it because I was like, yeah, I do, but... No, I do not. So, I got that. I've never used this before. We'll see. Doesn't have any smell. Maybe, like, real faint, faint, faint. Um, and then I was looking, and I saw this. I have used this before. This is Palmer's, uh, the Coconut Oil Hair Milk Smoothie. I have used this before, and my hair loves it. I stopped using it because this does have cones. And so I went through a period when I was like, no cones, period, poo. <laughs> and so I haven't used it since then. But now I am actually shampooing my hair. I do co-wash if I am changing my styles midweek. But from week to week, I actually shampoo my hair with a sulfate shampoo. And that is what you need to remove cones out of your hair or they will build up. So since I'm now uh, shampooing my hair, which I can see a difference in my hair. My hair has, I'm shaking it, but it's, <laughs> my hair has body and bounce and, you know, it moves and shaking. It's not even all that long. Of course, the longer your hair get, you will have movement from the weight but my hair isn't that long but i still have movement and now i know it's because i have removed all the products that that tends to build up on the hair but anyway i repurchased this and then so as i was looking at the palmer's display i saw this this is the uh matching styler to the hair milk it is the coconut oil curl styler cream pudding. I've never used this, but of course I have plans on doing a twist out or braid out and in conjunction, I will use these two. Uh, hmm, it smell like it's jiggly, huh? That kind of puts me in, my, in the mind of I think it's something by organic. Oh, I forget now, but yeah. So I'm gonna do, use that. It kind of stinks. Um, it kind of smell. I know. It's, I don't know. It, it it's supposed to have that coconut smell to it, so you can smell that. But it also kind of. You can tell that it's not 100% natural product. That's what you can tell. Um. Also by Palmer's, <clears throat> I purchased the olive oil 
leave-in conditioner for frizz prone hair it's a detangler heat protector and moisturizer in one i purchased this i've never used this either it's pretty thick so i, I got that i got the matching moisturizing hair milk and i have the matching <laughs> Uh, curl extend hair pudding for silky smooth shiny curls and I have the matching moisturizing feel styling neck to weightless curl definition with zero crunch for curls that pop ideal for high porosity hair I am now a colored natural so my hair is high porosity or it's, it's pretty it's medium to high I would say um I was low once upon a time, but that was before I really got into a good deep conditioning routine. So I'm no longer, even without being colored, I'm no longer low porosity. I'm more medium porosity. But now that I'm color treated, um, it's like it's medium high porosity. So that is all. Of course, they gave me a few little sample packets. Yeah. But that is all that I purchased as far as the hot you know as far as the, oh no and then i purchased this i forget i have the iso plus natural remedy tea tree and aloe oil sheen i purchased this for my clients that i do box braids on um if you guys have never watched a video of mine before i am a licensed cosmetologist and um i lately i've been doing a lot of braid styles um i think i really like braiding so braiding is probably going to be more my forte I will do silk presses if that's what someone requests. Well, I do whatever you request as long as it's not a relaxer, okay? <laughs> but I purchased this to put uh, on my braided clients. That's tea tree and aloe. I figured that would be really good for one, their scab, and then have two, you know, the shine for the braids. But I really purchased it for their uh, scab. So that's this is for my clients. Everything else is for my personal use. <laughs> and I'm going to make a few videos, of course, when, when I get around to using these. I'm not really sure when I'm going to get around to using them. I go in uh, to get to finalize my hair color Tuesday, which is the 15th. Um, and I have some products kind of lined up as far as what I'm going to use. Because the young lady that I'm going to, she only she does silk presses. I don't do silk presses. So after she colors me, I'm gonna have her to put some conditioner in my hair, shower cap, and I'm coming home and I style it when I get to the house. Um, so I do have some products in mind that I want to use for style for, to style that. I am going to try to record that because that is it's kind of piggybacking off a Instagram um an Instagram hairstylist, she posted something, and if I can figure out how to link like her video, I will link it um, below when I when I do my particular video. I'm using the products. I'm using the same products that she did. If I have it, so I have. She used four products. I have two of the four products that she used. The other two I am substituting for something that I feel is really close to what she used. But nevertheless. I just wanted you guys to see what I went into the store and purchased. Like I said, I went in to buy these two items and ended up buying one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight additional items. <laughs> Life of a product, like I tell you. All right, thank you so much for tuning in, guys. Uh, don't forget to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for subscribing. If you have already subscribed and you're watching this video, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And please stay tuned for more videos. T to, until next time, bye, guys.